residents this evening. Uh, thanks very much for your presence. Uh, you have honored us and we welcome you. Uh, the occasion for today uh, is the establishment by two uh, ladies uh, who are very esteemed members of the Turkish American community of the uh, Turkish American Business Women Association. But before that, let me say you tell you this. When I took the tour, the boat tour, in uh, uh, the Star Island, one of the great things that I hear is that one villa which has open air air condition system, which costs God knows how many millions. This is one of these days that I would love to have that system here. <laughs> and, and I think if I would suggest this to the Turkish government, and uh, they would, you know, uh, be very suspicious about my sanity. Uh, but so I will refrain from that. But thanks, thanks for being here today. Uh, one of our, of course, uh, objectives here as a new consul general is to uh, promote more business, more business between Turkey and the U.S. This part of the U.S. We have not been so far present here, and uh, I think that was a mistake. Now we're correcting that. Uh, of course, we need. A lot of support uh, from uh, our private community, and that includes the very vibrant, very active, uh, and sizable Turkish American uh, community, Turkish American uh, community which is almost 20,000 strong. And in this, I think uh, our one of our strengths is our women, actually. And uh, I always, I always say this. If we have more women in business, if, if we have more women in politics, I think the world is going to be a much better place. Bravo. Smart men. Very smart men. to my wife all the time. All the time. Uh, but joke aside, I really, from the bottom of my heart, I believe this is for world peace, for everything. We need more, more women. And uh, when two of our very nice ladies, uh, Miss Sevi and uh, Dr. Sevi uh, came to me and said that we want to establish a new Turkish American Business Women Association, I was really thrilled about that. I mean, uh, to initiate uh, such a, a project and to uh, try to have uh, more solidarity between uh, the Turkish American women here and try to connect this with Turkey so that it's beneficial to the communities here and Turkey. That sounds like a fantastic idea. And I said, you know what? I will throw a party for you guys so that you start this. So, uh, thank you. President of the uh, Turkish American Business Women's Association, and we welcome you once again. And uh, I would, on this occasion, uh, like to thank uh, uh, thank you very much, Mr. Mayor uh, of Coral Gables, Jim Kaysen, for uh, for honoring uh, this evening, and also the esteemed uh, uh, officials of the Miami-Dade County, yeah. Ma uh, Maria Dimitrios. <laughs> thank you very much for being here, uh, and uh, we have many. Uh, uh, members of the Turkish American uh, community here. We have professors from uh, FIU, for example. The FIU is an interesting university. Uh, I, I I went to the president, uh, Mark Rosenberg, and I said, you know, uh, we should have more uh, cooperation. And he said, yes, I would love that because we have an interesting situation in this university in terms of Turkey. Uh, he said, we have eight uh, Turkish students as opposed, to, as opposed to 32 uh, Turkish professors. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't understand this, he said. We need either 
we need to kick some of the professors out, which we don't want, which we don't want, or bring in more students. That's also another project that I'm working with the with the with the president. So, uh, for thank you for for being here. Uh, okay, please. <laughs> we gather tonight to celebrate the birth of our organization of Association of Turkish American Business Women. And as we see in other societies uh, in the world, as well as in Turkey, in the United States, the percentage of business owned or managed by women, women much lower than the men. And the same disparity can be seen in income earned by women too. Yes. And uh, the long-term purpose of our organization is to organize and empower Turkish and American women through networking with them, educating them about the business opportunities in the US and vice versa, and also supporting businesses owned by women, both in the United States and in Turkey. Uh, our short-term goals in 2015 are to focus on promoting our new organization by reaching Turkish and American women, uh, business owners, and uh, women in management, and uh, starting, uh, starting in our own backyard in South Florida, and increase our mem membership and bring awareness to various business opportunities between the U.S. and Turkey. Can I say something? Please, Mr. Um, I had the privilege of going to Turkey two years ago. It was the second time I got I toured the whole country. I was extremely impressed by the businesses I saw, the NGOs that were working around the world, and I came back a real supporter of Turkey. And um, our city has 160 corporate headquarters for Latin America. I'm hoping that we're going to get direct flights from Turkey. I was working on that when I was there. I come to Miami. Bring them back. We have 122 nationalities in the Gables. We have the University of Miami. Uh, we have our Coral Gables Chamber of Commerce that has 1,600 members who do a lot of networking. Um, if you would like, I would help you get in touch with not only the Coral Gables Women's Club, which represents a lot of people whose husbands, and, and they as well, are, are, are people who are very much involved in business. But the Coral Gables Chamber of Commerce is um, a terrific place to network. We have a lot of other groups and other nationalities that are there, so I think you should, you should be able to get plugged in quickly to these organizations. And Mark Trowbridge is the head of the, of the chamber. We've taken trips to Brazil. I'm doing one to Italy, uh, Canada, to uh, Colombia, and Guatemala shortly to promote business. We, I'm a very, very much in favor of, of, of business development. I used to run a U.S. Trade Center in Milan, Italy. And I remember back in when I did it in 1981, we, we did something unique. We invited Turkish companies to come in our trade center to promote Turkish products because they weren't really well known in Italy at that time. So I'm very much involved with um, trade promotion. Um, that's what our city is interested in doing, getting more international presence, more consulates. We're happy that you're living in the only city that you should be living in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, anything we can do for you, let me know. I'll get you in touch with all the people that you need to get your organization. Fantastic. Involved. We will take you up on that, okay. Mr. Mayor. Thank, Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers to our new yes. association. Yes. Cheers. Salam. <laughs> Cheers. Thank you for joining us tonight. Thank you for coming. Mm -hmm. uh, special mm -hmm. thanks for uh, our Turkish General Council, Mr. Um, Özgür Alkan, and uh, his lovely uh, wife, uh, Dr. Uh, Aslı Alkan. Thank you for, for everything. Yes. Thank, Thank you. You throw a party, you get more. Yeah. That's, that's really cool. <laughs> Thank you, Doctor. And also, uh, we owe a uh, special thanks to uh, Mr. Um, Eric uh, Nor, Eric Erkan Nor, for helping us set up this organization and getting it started, and all his support. Uh, please, could you come up, Mr. Nor? <laughs> Stay up here so we can take a picture off again. Yeah, okay. Thank you for everything. Thank you. Thank you. And, 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 and.
Yeah. Yes. 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 For us, uh, grateful. Yeah. Yeah. These places where uh, yeah. Hollywood yeah. Beach. Yes. Oh, but on the we don't like that here. We don't like that. We want one of these in World Game. <laughs> exactly. So keep that in mind. And one last thank you to uh, Schnelby's Winery for providing us the food wines. They're in the Redlands and they they make all kinds of wines from um, uh, tropical fruits. And he's not here, Mr. Schnelby. He was busy. I'm giving this to Mr. Tony Miar on behalf of Mr. Schnelby. On, on behalf of Peter Schnelby. Mr. Schnelby couldn't be here tonight. He apologizes for not being here. Uh, but he thanks uh, he thanks for the invitation and also for he wants to support this organization. Thank you on his behalf. Excellent. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, everybody. Thank you. Enjoy your evening. Put this for Peter in the box. Or let me put it over my stuff. Let me put it on my stuff. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Let me get. Uh, I know, but the camera's wrong. They moved. They moved. Yeah. They they took the they they went to the wrong spot because they went to the wrong area. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Oh, they locked the door here. Oh yeah yeah. All right. I'll see you. Bye bye. See you know how to get home. GPS. <laughs> Early morning. Right. I know. I know. <laughs> us too. Us too. I know. Six six o'clock. Yeah yeah. We'll be there. Let me get a picture with the consulates. Wait, so we can get a picture with them. Um, Sevi. Sevi. Let me excuse me. I'm try to steal her a minute. Can I steal you for a minute? Can I steal you for a minute? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. One minute, just one minute. Uh, Eva, 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 Peter, Peter. Sevi, let me get a picture from Sevi. Oh, oh, it's okay. No, 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 it's not okay. Come. Sevi, one minute, because Peter has to leave, so we can take a picture. It's only one minute. Sev? Sevi? I want to get. Sevi, one minute. Sevi! Do it, Sevi! One minute, come on. Okay, that's great. I did 38 here, my wife's from El Salvador. Let me get um. No, no, by them, just, just them. No, no, honey, with, with the counselor, right here. Just right here is fine. Well, yeah, I mean, we got